What's up, Champions fam? It's Zeke Forno back in a brand new WWE Champions video. And as you all can see, Feud Prep has finally gone live in game. And the first feud of this upcoming weekend series of Flash Feuds is going to be focused solely around our champion waifus. Now, this is definitely going to be an interesting one, to say the least. And that's not even considering the multitude and plethora of strap metal combinations that could be involved, as well as the maxed out perks, but this is definitely going to be an interesting one to say the least, and it could ultimately turn into one hell of a slaughter knocker of a feud for sure, but as long as we ride it out, weather the storm, play smart, and have a good time, it's going to be all right nonetheless. So let's go ahead and just check out these line bonuses, and then I will be out of your hair. First and foremost, we have the main event slot. And in order to get this fill bonus, you are going to need a female acrobat as well as a four-star Sasha. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I do not know if this pertains only to April 2020's Spring in the Ring MLC prize wall champion, modern era showboat Sasha Banks, the boss, or if you could actually run a four-star trickster zombie Sasha instead. So if you have either, can you please leave in the comments down below which one pertains to this slot for Sasha or if both of them can be utilized here. But the fill bonus for the main event slot is going to be increase your war score by 10%. Plus three move charge towards red moves and plus 100% finisher damage. Now, like I stated, there are two Sashas in the game, Zombie Sasha and Human Sasha. But when it comes to the Acrobats, though, we have a couple of waifus that we can look towards. We got two free-to-play waifus and none other than Bailey, this Spring in the Ring MLC free-to-play champion. And we also have Alexa Bliss. So those are two Free to play waifus that can be used here. All that's missing is the four star Sasha. But finally, another solid acrobat option for the ladies is none other than the Shinom Ember Moon, the female copy and paste variant of X Pac. But all three of those are solid options. But remember, you need a four star Sasha. And again, I have to say it again if you own either a four star zombie Sasha or you have recruited the boss modern era showbo sasha please leave a comment down below to let the fam know which one counts towards this fill bonus then we move to the mid card because we actually don't have a bottom card this time around five female champions in total can be utilized here if you can hit the requirements this time around in order to hit these fill bonuses you're going to need a four star Attitude Era Powerhouse, China, the ninth wonder of the world. Rest in paradise, baby girl. You're going to need her for the first slot. Then for the other two, here's where things get interesting because the fill bonus here is going to be plus 50% blast gem damage, plus 25% multiply gem damage, and finally, plus two all MP. So let's get real. You need China for the first slot, but who can go into the other two slots? Well, you could run Brie Bella, Brie Mode, absolute beast mode in my opinion, a female copy and paste variant of Big Cass for that ass, blowing up the board with all those blast gems, making it easy to cycle, dealing crazy damage as a powerhouse. You could run her. And then you also got another option. You got two options, actually, when it comes to multiply gems. I might be missing out on another variant for blast gems, but I really think it's only Bree next to China. Um, but for that multiply gem damage, you got two ways to go here, and both of them are showboats. You can either go with um, Showboat Charlotte, or you can go with another free-to-play waifu and Showboat Legend, Wendy Richter, a copy and paste of Jeff hardy so this is the sl uh, this is the setup for this feud it's going to be interesting to say the least now you can at least cover two slots here the acrobats because alexa you can pull from anywhere bailey is the uh, bailey is um spring in the ring april 2020's mlc free-to-play champion so everybody should have her at this point in time hopefully hopefully so you can either use alexa or bailey here if you've spent already and you pulled 
Amber Moon the Shinam. You could use her there up in the top slot next to Sasha. But then you also have Wendy Richter, who was also another free-to-play waifu. And some of these champions are featured at different star rarities within the league loots, the silver league loot, that is. So that's something else to consider. There's also a chance to pull these champions in the briefcase pulls, because I know for sure that Brie Bella Brie Mode, as well as her sister Nikki Bella Fearless, are both featured within the free-to-play briefcase pulls for the Spring in the Ring MLC for April 2020. Now, whether or not you pull them or not is up in the air, but hey, if you do get them, they are at four-star, I believe. You can at least get them up to four-star. So, there's a couple ways to get around this, but be prepared. There are going to be some top uh, some top faction mates out there that actually go, that actually have all these slots covered, and it's going to be a slobber knocker. You're going to have to work hard to get those points, but that's when the strap and metal combinations come into play as well as the perks. So utilize those to your advantage. And again, you don't got a bottom slot to worry about. You got. If anything, five waifus to worry about each time you go into a feud. But that's pretty much it, y'all. Um, let me know your thoughts about this first feud. Think, think about it. We got a Flash feud series coming up. So this is the first of many. So let me know how you're going to go about this. And please, if any of you own both Zombie Sasha as well as the boss Showboat Sasha, or if you own one or the other, let me know who pops up for that Sasha slot, so everyone within the fam is fully aware and know what to look out for, but uh, bad times don't last, but champions do, I hope you all having a blessed day, I hope you all had a blessed weekend, you know, Triple Crown's about to conclude, Showdown is coming gone, I hope you were able to reap the rewards for your efforts, and um, stay tuned y'all, mad love always, and until next time, let me know your thoughts about this upcoming ladies feud, Peace.